Coach Fulgerson said that you had your best quarter of the time here in Morgantown last week. What are the things that you saw when you look back on it, aside from two touchdowns that you can grow on and you know, that did work for you? When did you say that? Today, I think. It was said that. The fourth quarter? Yeah. Oh. After one uh, of the worst quarters before that, you said. Probably. Uh, <laughs> fair, fair assessment. Um, you know, it's, it's like I said before, after the game, it's a, it's a long, it's a long game. You can't really dwell on what happened the last quarter, necessarily the last play. Um, you know, you just got to control what you control, and that's you know all I did. And you know, that, it made it easy when you're throwing to those guys, and I'm throwing to, and having those guys up front. But are there things that you saw when you looked at the film that you said, okay, you know, more of this? Let's get this going from the first quarter all the way through against Texas. Um, I mean, they're they're a good defense. They do what they do, and we can we have some we have a good game plan against them. And we just keep doing what we're doing. I mean, the offense is improving every week, and we're looking to uh, improve this week. So, but uh, as a, as a guy who grew up watching them as a fan, night games in Morgantown, it's your first one that you actually get to play in. What is this going to be like for you? It'll be exciting. Um, you know, you can't put too much into it because you still got to play the game. But uh, at some point, you still want to, you know, you know, look look at it and realize what you're doing and what you're in, the situation you're in. So it's going to be exciting. Um, it's going to be hard not to, uh, you know, get caught up in the emotion. But that's that's my job: to stay even keel and continue to play. You remember specifically any of those games that you were maybe in the yeah, stands or sideline? Yeah. Um, from when we first started and beat Virginia Tech, you know, what 2003. I mean, the Louisville game, I mean, there's just been so many night games. Uh, what was my last one? I think Rutgers in overtime when they had Ray Rice um, and Jarrett Brown had to come in. There's I mean, there a lot of games, a lot of good memories. So. Well, you mentioned them briefly. What, what are you going up against when Texas comes down? They're a good team. Um, you know, they made a defensive coaching change, and uh, since then they've been pretty basic, but, you know, they're pretty much playing man coverage all the time, which is pretty smart because they got some pretty good guys to cover. Um, number two last week for TCU was pretty good. Um, but as a whole, as a defense, these guys match up pretty well. They're, they're good cover guys. And up front, they're good. You know, they're you know highly recruited guys and highly talented guys. Um, so just, you know, another good formidable Big 12 defense.